Hi, this is uh, Gigi Vixen, and I am responding to a Tumblr user who posted a video by a YouTube user, Kiara Torres, who was responding to a video by U YouTube user, Tyrannosaurus Lex, which admittedly I haven't watched as suggested as my own thoughts for the initial video that I watched are taking precedence here. I really liked your views on the subject. For me, it wasn't a matter of being brave or having nothing to say. For me, when I simply like a video, I look to what has already been said. If there is nothing more I can add to the pre-existing comments, then why should I waste my time and theirs being repetitive and dull? But you are right. The YouTube community has become less of a community. But I don't think that is solely exclusive to YouTube. Many community sites have the same issue, be it DeviantArt, Facebook, Tumbl or Tumblr, where I, found, where I found your video, and probably many other sites that exist that I know about but aren't a part of due to lack of interest or the time to invest in such sites. There are many reasons the internet in general and these sites in particular have such issues as you are addressing. Mostly because those who grew up with the beginnings of the internet and these sites have started raising families and pursued various careers, and thus not having the time or energy to pursue online communities. Those that do have time usually aren't very emotionally invested in it nevertheless. But mainly the bulk of what makes up current internet community are people that are probably under workforce age, meaning around 16 years old or less. Also, there is a problem that the anonymy itself provides everything, that anonymy, autonomy itself, God, I can't speak, forgive me, this is a, I'm not good at making videos. But anyway, there's also the problem that uh, being anonymous provides with everything on the internet, such as the free reign to act like a douche and talk like a stereotypical troll, not to mention the net and tech speak that is by people who are on the level that you are and I are on are difficult to translate. To me, if you're an American above the age of 16, you should be able to relay your thoughts, ideas, and opinions in a solid sentence paragraph format. If you feel unable to do so, please get help in this regard. Being able to type a f type full sentences in proper English with a semblance of proper capitalization, grammar, and punctuation are essential skills. And saying stupid things like, I ain't got time for that, is the lamest excuse ever. If you took time to say something, take time to say it properly. Because there is no Google Translator for net tech speak that I know of. And if you're a native English speaker above the age of 16, there is no excuse why you can't say, I like, dislike this, and this is why. Insert your list of reasons here. Or, I liked and disliked this because of, again, insert your reasons. Also, hatred and rage is a problem this and other internet communities have. Because of the differing opinions in this world, not everyone agrees. Allowing comments sets up an environment where verbal wars and drama can easily take root and flourish. Now, that isn't to say I'm innocent in this regard, because I suppose I have done my uh, share of perpetuation of anger rage towards others, mostly fandoms I follow, and mostly because... Many of my opponents seem to lack proper English skills and do not seem to understand human psychology or sociology at all. <laughs> I'm a college graduate, what can I say? Uh, anyway, I'm sorry for ranting and blabbing for so long, but basically I totally agree with what you have said in your video. I really think we need to get back to commenting and responding to each other's, uh, each other's works, uh, ideas and thoughts that we have that we have, uh, this is not very good, that <laughs> I think we really need to get back to commenting and responding to each other and the thoughts and ideas and works that we have presented in public formats 
where comments are allowed in community forums. I really miss having feedback. It's becoming very lonely on DeviantArt and Tumblr in particular because no one really says anything to me anymore. And maybe it's because I'm just not interesting or whatever, but I don't think that's re really the issue because I'm basically part of communities that are getting feedback and I'm not getting feedback, whatever. The most I get is a fave, and while this is great, I really want to know why you liked it. Be detailed, be honest without sounding like a douche, and maybe you'll make a difference in this world by making a difference in someone's life, such as myself. Because isn't that what we all want? To make a difference, to make a world a better place? The choice is yours, folks. Either stand up and make a difference, or don't, and let what was once great internet communities die and be forgotten. Tis a shame if the latter happens. Truly a shame.